everybody and welcome back to my kitchen. I'm your chef, Chef Ryan. Um, today we're going to be making pizza. Um, we're making a white pizza with Alfredo sauce. So let's get started on that sauce. All right, everybody. So we've got about one tablespoon of melted butter in this low to medium heat pan. We're going to crush one clove of garlic to go in there. mince it, I mean. Uh, and then we're going to cook this for one minute until the garlic gets fragrant. All right, it's been about one minute, so we're going to go ahead and add one tablespoon of flour into this. The flour really helps to thicken up the Alfredo sauce. We're going to go ahead and whisk that together. this for another minute. I have this little mini whisk which I really like. Uh, it's very helpful for things like this. Um, so you can see that's what it looks like right now. Just this little mixture. All right and now we're gonna go ahead and add our one cup of milk into this, the main ingredient of the Alfredo sauce. And then we're gonna mix that, whisk that together once again. Um, and then once this gets simmering, we're gonna let it simmer um, and reduce and start to thicken up. Um, all right. Oh. Our Alfredo sauce has been thickening here for a while, simmering down. We're gonna go ahead and add a quarter cup of Parmesan cheese to that. And then whisk that in. This adds the cheesiness to the creaminess of the sauce um, as that Parmesan melts into the, into the sauce. Now we're gonna go ahead and add some salt. Add some pepper. Whisk that in again. Turn the heat down a bit, and then we're gonna go again ahead and give this a taste test. I would say that is pretty damn good. All right, and now we are gonna go ahead and start assembling our pizza. So we have our floured pizza pan here. We have some veggies over here, mushroom, peppers and onions, how my sister likes it. Um, and then we've got this whole wheat dough. Uh, it's from the store, it's from Wegmans, but I would have preferred to make it homemade, but you know, this is a bit easier. Um, and then over here we've got our cheeses and a bit of pepperoni. So let me just get this pizza dough lined up over the pizza pan and I'll be right back. All right, so we've got that dough in the pan there and now we're gonna pour our Alfredo sauce over there. That should be good. Let me go ahead and spread that out. As you can see, I've made a little bit of a crust around the edge by folding over the dough. Um, then we're gonna go ahead and sprinkle a layer of mozzarella cheese over the entire pizza.
That appears good. And then let's put some pepper in there. So tonight I'm feeding my dad, my brother, and my sister, and myself. Can you turn that TV off? Dad! I'm filming. Okay, so Kevin and Dad's half we're, are gonna have pepperoni on it. Like so. That appears good. Catherine likes vegetables, so we're gonna give her some onions, a couple of peppers, and then some mushrooms too. cheese on my quarter, I guess. Oh, that's a lot. Um, that seems pretty good to me. So I've got my oven set to 400 degrees. We're gonna put this in the oven for um, maybe about 20 minutes until the cheese gets bubbly and the crust is cooked through. All right, everybody, we're just about ready to take this pizza out of the oven. It looks nice and good. Here we have it. Cheese looks nice and golden brown. The crust is nice along the edges. Um, looks good. Thanks. All right. All right. Are we on? Yep. All right. Yeah. I'm, I'm tasting. Yes, I'm, I'm tasting the pizza with the meat crust from Wendy's. Very tasty. Excellent. Delicious. I think the crust tastes good. I'd get it again. Mm, it's a bit underdone, the crust. No, I, I don't like it burned on the bottom, so I think no. I think it came out perfectly. Nice and light brown. Yeah, it's good. It's flavorful. Yeah, very good. Yeah, it's a winner. We'll be doing this one again. Thanks, Ryan. Ah. All right, you heard that. Thumbs up. Um, everybody had their pizza. The dinner went nicely, so. Now it's time to clean up. Let's debrief a little bit. I'm in my bedroom right now, laying in my bed because my back kind of hurts. But um, I'd say that went pretty well. Um, a little bit of an easier recipe than those crispy chicken sandwiches. Um, everybody liked it. Um, solid recipe. Definitely am gonna make it again. Um, perhaps change it up with the cheeses or whatnot. But uh, that 
concludes episode two of Cooking with Ryan. Um, make sure to like and subscribe and share. Um, thank you, everybody. Bye-bye.